And y'all, I had to put my shirt on for this one. And you my fan on and stuff. You might can't hear me. But before y'all come for me about that abuse, like I said, when you in the industry, you'll think they know more. If Jaguar Wright can know about P. Diddy and somebody who already established, grounded in the music industry, can hear these rumors and still decide to date this man, then when this man is hurting you, you're not even expressing it to anyone. So you are then coddling him and dealing with all the rumors on high that was true. But did he when he first hit you, did you walk away and he just forced you? Or did you keep being in this relationship? They even said you knew about it when he did it to his wife. I thought he loved and cherished that girl so much. It felt like something that flew behind me. Y'all my window up. I hate having my window up. Especially around the summertime. Yeah, my um thing on my window messed up. So it'd be like if a fly by fly fly by it can get in there. I gotta fix that. But so in it damn way. That's my point. Sis, did something fly by me? I can't stand bulls, bro. Why do bulls exist? Nah, nah. Like, but that again, a Jaguar right? Because, I mean, it just baffles me. How you can deal with it all this long time. Then as soon as when you fed up and you feel like you done got the evidence to get your bag. Then like, it still baffles me to this day like Dre or Kelly wife. When she joined the show years back and I first seen the show, I said, I know she not talking about R. Kelly like that. And who is this woman talking about she R. Kelly wife? But it just made me be like, all right, I'll Google, that is his wife. She was speaking, sh mm -mm. volumes then. I mean, in the Bible, it says you're supposed to stick to, you know, to your hood through thick and thin. So no matter what he went through, if she still was representing him like she did on her Instagram on a live video. Hey, the Bible says... But, again, if y'all just feel like I don't have empathy, no remorse, it comes from a place where you're here. I put myself here, sis. I went through that. And you just have to go through that because you chose to go through that. You chose to deal with that. You need to learn from that, grow from that. Step your ass down, cause is it not? Is it not about the money? I guess because he has so much money, that's the only reason it matters. For years, um, people have been accusing P Diddy of. Every time I get on the internet, it's I'm like for years, and then Cassie, the hotel video, leaked. And now, P. Diddy is under heavy investigation for child abduction, uh, sex with minors, uh, beating on women, uh. A person that ain't even made it in the social life for real, I just discovered Jaguar Wright been saying this and a lot of other people when you start looking into it and she decided to date him and I guess you thought your color or maybe just you I ain't gonna say your color sis my bad maybe just you thought you could change him now you want everybody to have sympathy because you stepped your ass over there in the alligator pit and I already told y'all, like I said in the other video, a man with the money, he he think he he high. 
And this nigga got more than money. This man, I just found out he graduated from Harvard with a fake scholarship. And they taking everything back nowadays because, guess what? Society is kicking him to the curb. What the hell? My baby fighting to get into Harvard. She ready for that to be on her. You know, all the, I've told y'all, so many schools want her. But she just want what she want. Harvard, do we get Harvard? Do we get some other big ass school? And I'm like, huh? But this man, because he got money, who his status is and who he is, he can generate this. Sit the fuck down. Like, I'm just saying, to come at me like, weird is weird. Because y'all got to just think, when you get older, you grow. Oh, she's younger than you. When you in the industry, you like 20 years. Have you ever seen a, a, one of your favorite artist kids, and the next thing you see, they like 15? Then when they do an interview, you like, damn. Is she 15? She's smart as hell. I mean, because they just know and see stuff. It gets to them first. If they if it don't get to them because they so busy with their life, the internet, they don't show hype it up to where it's first coming to them. And you still decide to step in the alligator pit. Thinking you something different. Well, us broke girls be thinking we something different. We could change a man. Maybe he'll see the light. But some of us be like, trying to fight it. And we just get look, act like a crazy person. Imagine me. Going through that with someone like PD, you would be like, girl, clean that damn bathroom and get you some curtains that match and find you a bra. Get your damn hair done. Stop working at these fast food. Shut up. You can't even take care of your kid. It would be. And I, I decide not to record things because. I don't want to get in trouble with my new man, P. Diddy. And you like, what the evidence? What a proof, fat bitch. Call me all like my name. Not believing a dang on thing I'm saying. Because he, him, and you broke ass girl with five kids. Shit, the hell. Long guy. Long guy. Well, y'all have a blessed day. I'm just saying. Camera cut, but we still doing action. Y'all yeah, looking at this big ass Granddad Lonely right now. I don't kill Granddad Lonely. I just think it's disrespectful for him to show his face right now. But I haven't been talking to my spiders for a minute. I'm crawling on his door. But anyway, yo. Love y'all. Have a blessed night. Day.